Hi, my name is Jamie Landman, and I'm the Chair of the Department of Urology at the University of California, Irvine. My area of focus is largely in kidney disease, with a particular focus in kidney cancer and the minimally invasive management of that disease, as well as kidney stones, again with a minimally invasive focus, and, and pretty much anything that has to do with kidney surgery, so kidney blockage or kidney transplant. Remarkably, while kidney cancer is one of the most devastating diseases, it typically is found, in our experience, about 80% of the time with no symptoms at all. People just happen to have an ultrasound, a CT, or some imaging study for some other reason, and they find them. The good news is that type of kidney cancer is usually found as a very small lesion and can be easily treated. Occasionally, larger kidney cancers are found when they're symptomatic. So people have the typical symptoms of a cancer, meaning they feel weak, tired, weight loss, loss of appetite, etc. Or you can actually feel a pain uh, in the flank, which is the area between the ribs and the spine here, or actually feel a mass. These are usually more advanced cancers. Occasionally, people will have blood in the urine, which we call hematuria, and this is also a sign of potentially having kidney cancer.